everyone, my name is Kate and I am in New York right now. I'm Canadian so whenever I fly down here I try to order as much American stuff as I can um, to avoid duty charges and taxes. So I sent them all to my hotel room here in New York. So I'm going to show you four dresses and then a pair of shoes. I am currently in my third trimester. I am 30 weeks pregnant. So this is it's a little tricky to try stuff on. Dawn is really mom and woman centric and so the, a lot of their styles are bump friendly, they don't call them maternity, but they definitely work for a baby bump. So what they usually tell you is to um, keep the same size that you usually are and that isn't really the case in my experience right here. So I'll show you what I have um, and how it looks on. But um, yeah, I've had to size up in a couple things. I'm at the very end of my pregnancy, so I'm starting to swell. It's just this really beautiful time <laughs> when I'm just slowly getting bigger. My rings don't fit, etc. So, but I will definitely show you the dresses and then I'll show you the details because Doan is so good at the details. The fabric is absolutely stunning. So, the first thing I ordered is the Anima dress, which I ordered this in a small and medium, and then the medium fit me. Um, and this is just beautiful. So this is their French blue color. This also this dress also comes in white, which is really beautiful. It reminds me a lot of their uh, Tanzine dress from last year. Um, and I think this is just stunning. So this is a fabric that they apparently worked on for over a year. It's cotton um, and it has this like a really stunning eyelet. It has a very low um, rounded square neckline, which is very beautiful. Um, I really like how it fits on their model Alex, which is like a little bit loose, so I ordered the medium hoping that that would look that way on me, but again, I'm very swollen, so um, it just fits fine. So um, what I usually wear at Doan is a small or an excess, and this is a medium. I have one dress that's in a medium there, that's because of the arms, the primrose, um, so that's not usually my normal size, but I think this dress is really beautiful if you were in the market for something new. Um, it's really pretty, really classic. I love the puff sleeve and then this embroidery detail which I will show you more details of when I try it on. And then this is the uh, Nima in medium in the French blue. The blue is just absolutely gorgeous. I like this fabric a lot but it's just very tight. This is a medium. It fits fine. Um, but yeah, I'm just not in love with it. I don't know, I don't know if it is, I think it's the neckline that I'm just not a big fan of. Um, it's very princess, <laughs> which I don't really mind, but I'm not sure if it's my style, so I don't know if I just have to get used to it. And the sleeves are really puffy because of just being folded, so you can see that. So I think the color is really beautiful. I think the shape is nice. The fabric is so soft. This is the fabric up close. It's very delicate, very pretty. Delicate in that it's like beautiful, like in the intricate, but it's not like, I don't feel like I'm gonna ruin it. Like I would wear this around my children. It's just so pretty. I love this color. The detail is just stunning. Next up is the forever sold out <laughs> Raven dress. So this dress um, was recently recently restocked in all sizes, but I had like fought tooth and nail to get my size, which is a small, in this. Um, what you do is you sign up for an email notification when someone like returns it. And so three days in a row I missed it, and then finally I was just sitting there because it's usually around noon, 2 p.m. my time that they have had restocked this one. And I finally got my hands on it, and it's too small, so I'm like pretty sad. I definitely need a medium in this one, but it is just something that I'm not going to go with at this time because I don't really want to order outside of my size range for after baby so I can wear it. But I absolutely love this. It's just like a faded, it's almost, it's faded but like in a vintage way, floral. It's like this gorgeous dark orange, red, and green with a little bit of yellow print. And what's so stunning is this very beautiful ruffle at the top and on the sleeve. And what makes it so unique, I think, is the, the smocking that they have on the side. So this is elastic, and it stretches to conform to your body within reason. It doesn't conform to my body. It has a zipper on the way back, on the back, that's a hidden zipper. And then it has layers of um, panels that are horizontal. So this is really beautiful. This was my number one choice going into 
um, all these purchases, I guess, because I think this is just very wearable. Um, it's sold out again, I can't believe it. I just went to, I was thinking of ordering a medium, um, and then it's gone. So um, I'll think again. I have a dress that I'm gonna stick with, um, and that's at the end of this. I did email them asking about the restock, and they did restock in all sizes, like they said, and they said that they are actually gonna have it probably in some more sizes and um, in some more colors and prints because it is so popular because it is like um, one of their most coveted like styles. So don't be discouraged if you didn't get your size. Sign up for the notifications, see if you can get that, grab one. But otherwise, I think we're gonna see more of the beautiful Raven in the future. And this is the Raven, which yeah, you can definitely see clearly, <laughs> clearly too tight. But um, so this is, sorry, that's my bra poking out. Everything fits perfectly when you're wearing it. Um, this is an elastic gore, which I think is so cool and is really good for fit. Um, obviously it only stretches so far because I can't close this. That's as far as I can get it up and I'm not gonna force it. Um, but I think this is really pretty otherwise. So you can see the ruffle detail. This is really cool how it goes all the way down and then the smocking um, elastic on the side and then it goes all the way up and then you can see the ruffle up here. This is really pretty. Really, 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 really pretty. And this is the beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Fiore dress. I, I never really thought about this dress, this print. Tw like I didn't think about it at all when they first came out with it because I don't know. I didn't think it was anything special online on their site. But then I saw real people wearing it. So if you go to Instagram and click where Doan is tagged, or and click the hashtag, um, search the hashtag Doan Collective, um, you're gonna find so many beautiful real women wearing these styles and honestly that has influenced me to grab a couple that I didn't think that I would like um, including this one and the next one I have so this is so nice this fabric is beautiful so this is 100% cotton I just had to check again because it is so soft it almost feels like silk like it is beautiful um, so this is the Octavia print and this is a Fiore style so it has these two um, panels of ruffles here and then a puff sleeve and then a ruffle here the sleeves are not elastic and it has this really beautiful panel here that is reminiscent of just like a very vintage victorian style i think this is so pretty i think it's a little bit young on me it looks a little bit makes me look like a, a bit of a five-year-old but i've seen some women rock it and they look amazing including ariel charnez who you'll see if you look at the people who are tagged in um with doan dresses so this is really beautiful um this compared to the one next is the bijou um people uh, i've argued with others about what which one is more wearable some people say this one some people say the bijou which i will get to but this is a really really beautiful option this also comes in a blue a pink and a white i think so um, Doan loves it so they and, and they think that everyone else should because they have it in all the colors so try this out um, this is really beautiful I got this in a small this one doesn't fit me either you'll see it in the try on how the the side panel the side zipper doesn't do all the way up um, but that's okay because um, I'm gonna stick with the bijou which I will show you next and this is the small Fiore in the Octavia print and it's really cute it feels almost like a little juvenile for me I think it's because of the um, ruffle up here. I've seen some people pull it off, so that's just my opinion. But um, yeah, the ruffle here and then the puff sleeve. I don't know, maybe it's just short puff sleeve that I have a problem with. But the print again is beautiful. This is clearly too tight. You can see my flesh <laughs> right there. So this is not one, at least at the end of pregnancy, to um, buy your normal size in Doan because I would have to go up to a medium. This is just, yeah, really pretty. Again, this cotton is so nice. Like, I highly recommend this fabric. I think it is beautiful. Um, but yeah, I would size up if you are planning to get this if you're in your third trimester pregnant. So very specific. <laughs> Um, I do think it's pretty, but yeah, it's just not for me. Um, let me show you some of the lace detail here. I want to show you the details while it's off because it's easier to see. So this is that like um, waist piece. And I think this is um, at a good uh, height for if you're pregnant. Um, definitely at the beginning of your pregnancy. Um, so don't be afraid of that. 
this is, yeah, the pretty lace I was showing you before. And then look at this. This is like this like ruffle and then this lace up here and then the sleeve. Like they know how to do details at Dylan. It is so beautiful. Um, the sleeve is not elastic. I just wanted to let you know that, but I think there's plenty of room in there. And yeah, this is just really, 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 really pretty. The ends are finished. I could just like go all day looking <laughs> at this fabric and studying it. It is just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. This dress is so pretty. This also comes in a white and a blue, like the French blue, like I showed you. And it is so lovely. So the way they have it styled online is they have the sleeve puffed up like this, which it makes it look almost costumey and which is why I wasn't really interested in it in the first place. But then Sam, Samantha from, could I have that? She's, could I have that as her Instagram handle? has this and then someone else, and then someone else I know actually just um, uh, tailored this. They're gonna take this this sleeve, this mocking sleeve off of it so that it's just like, it leaves a little puff sleeve. So, um, which I think is a really cool idea. But um, I love the sleeve. What I saw on the other people is that the sleeve wasn't as dramatized, like the puff wasn't as dramatized, and you'll see that on me. It just looks like a normal sleeve, which I prefer the look of. And as soon as I saw that on, on them, I was like, I need to try this dress. And I'm so glad I did. This is so beautiful. It's the sister of the Saul dress from last season. The Saul dress has more of a ruffle here and it has a longer puff sleeve, I think that goes down here. So this is a different version of that. Again, this fabric is so beautiful. I cannot believe it's just cotton. Like it is, there's something magic in here. It is so beautiful. And it just makes me feel really great. This alas, this string doesn't function. Um, it's just for design, and but this one does. So that is something else to think about. I just love the smocking. I think the smocking is going to be good for me. It's very stretchy, so I can actually breastfeed in it, and that's another plus. I don't think I can breastfeed in the rest of them. So this one I definitely can, so I'm going to keep it, and I just love it. The more and more I wear it, the more I just like fall in love with it, and it just makes me feel amazing. So I think that is a very important quality in a dress. Um, it should make you feel amazing. Everything you should wear should, should make you feel amazing, but... Um, so I would definitely try the Bijou. If you um, haven't yet, I think this is, and if you're in the market for a dress that will make you feel amazing, because I think this is lovely. This isn't a small, this isn't my normal size, and that's another reason why I'm happy to keep it. And yeah, this is what the back looks like, and I will show you on the try-on. And this is the Bijou, which fits the best, and is really, 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 really pretty. <laughs> um, so my concern with this, and before, and I didn't like this dress, was the sleeves, because it was really puffy um, that they styled on the site. But I like it, I like these a lot. I think this frill on the top is so pretty, and it's on the sleeve. So you can see right here, that this is another problem area, that you can see your bra strap, unless it's like on the really outside part of your um, cup on the bra. My thing is, my only thing is, um, with this is like, I kind of want to love it for a long time. Like I want to love it for a couple years, not just like for one year. So I'm just wondering if this style, if this print, if I'm going to really love it, um, yeah, next year. So you'll see in the back too, you can see my bra strap on that side, but not on the other side. So yeah, that's definitely something to think about. It's a little bit, can you see my underwear? Yep. A little bit sheer. <laughs> Again, I would ne wear nude underwear with this anyway. Um, but yeah, let me get, let you have a close-up of the um, fabric. Ugh. It feels really, really like silky. So it's like a very, very soft cotton. And then it has, yeah, this really beautiful texture to it. These are the colors. It's more of an orangey red and this bright blue. The more I wear it, the more I love with this dress I am becoming. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard to make a decision when something doesn't seem like a practical idea, but I think if you really, really love it, that trumps that because I could buy black dresses all the time and like obviously that's very practical, but I might not necessarily reach for them when it comes to um, an occasion. And so, um, yeah, I really love this. I think I would wear this. I could wear this to church. I could wear this all the time, really. And I really, I know it's white, 
but I think the fact that it has this print makes it a little bit more friendly, kid friendly, definitely. I have two kids, one on the way, so I mean, it has to be kid friendly. I think I'm gonna keep this, yeah. <laughs> the more I put, the, more, the longer I wear this, the more in love with this, and it just makes me feel really like special, and I think that's important, so I think I'm gonna keep this one. And the last thing I got from Dylan are the Mary Jane slippers. So I have these, these are uh, velvet. This is the color rose copper. So you can see that it has like quite the nap. It's like, see that changes with the direction of the light. And the color of this was always a little bit questionable to me um, online, but it's, it's pretty true to what you see online. It's not a true pink. Um, and I can see why they call it a copper because it has like almost an orange to it. This is in a seven and a half. They're old, they're original versions of the Mary Janes are, didn't have half sizes, and I have a seven in that. I'm normally a seven and a half or eight. Um, I have these in gold, and I love them. So I was like, I need to try this pink color because that's what I wanted, but they didn't, um, they didn't redo their old pink, which was like a very light pink. So I wanted to try these ones in a seven and a half, so they have the half sizes now, but they're a little too small. I think they're a little too small on me because of, again, pregnancy. So I'm not gonna keep them. But I think they're beautiful and I think that they do fit a little on the small side. So if you're looking for um, new shoes on these ones, I think they fit a little on the small side in general. But I think these are beautiful. I definitely want to try their ballet flats. Um, yeah, by the time I can fit these, maybe it will be the fall. So I'll have to see and reorder them. But I think they're just stunning. And that's my doing video. That's what I ordered to my hotel room. I'm going to keep the bijou because it is magic in a dress as usual. Doen just does such a beautiful job at the details and they definitely reach out and find their customer who loves these details and just like makes them feel like amazing. So I'm very happy with my bijou, wish the shoes fit, wish everything else fit just cause for like my own personal like morale and confidence, <laughs> but uh, temporary condition. If you have any questions, let me know and I will talk to you later. Have a good day.